question that we commonly get asked here at Water Babies is, what does it take to become one of our teachers? So, back in 2017, I followed Nicole's journey, and one year on, I thought I'd show you guys what it really does take. So we had, God, we had five weeks before I got here um, for some coursework with feedback from mm -hmm. the assessor. Yeah, so we have um, seven chapters, I suppose you can call it, on different areas. So some are about um, safety aspects, some about children, some about the equipment, some about how you would deal with certain scenarios and different things. And it's not really something that you can read in a book and then answer. Yeah. You have to. It makes you think. First um, two days, um, it's um, really looking at sort of the real foundation. So chapter one and chapter two, it's really making sure that the key skills that the guys are learning um, uh, are really sort of embedded. And so we talk a lot about things like demo quality, making sure that um, everything is really up to standard. Um, so first couple of days, it's quite repetitive. There's quite a lot of repeating of skills um, and sort of getting them to sort of really get that kind of physical confidence in the water and delivering the skills to that quality level that, that we want. Um, so now they are um, working on chapter four. So where the chapter four progressions are is that there's a lot of building on previously learned skills for the clients. And that's the same for the teachers, basically. So a lot of the stuff they're doing now is quite fast paced. Um, the guys have learned so much already and they're just, they're just building on from that basically. So, yeah. so we spent uh, all morning in the pool since 8 in the morning. We've had lunch and now we're back in the pool for our afternoon session. I take my role really seriously as a tutor in that it needs to be um, really enjoyable. Um, so I think it's a real, it's a real experience. Um, I think um, depending on the character, for some people it can be quite intense, but for a lot of people it's just really, really enjoyable and they look back on it with real sort of hazy nostalgia. It's hard work, there's no, no bones about it, but if you're doing something that you really feel passionate about, then that hard work is, is really rewarding. It's 25 past 6, I've got homework to do, dinner in about half an hour, we've still got some activity to do and plan for a lesson for tomorrow because 8 o'clock in the morning I'm in the pool teaching to everyone. I had my feedback today actually. Yes. Good? Yeah, better than I thought. I don't know why I was so nervous. Miss my family. Yeah. I'm so tired. I don't even have the energy to call them. <laughs> 